I'm a geologist, so I work with rocks to um, find out about ice sheets, how thick they were in the past. Um, I've been four times in the last 10 years, so I'll probably go every three years or so on average. Um, so I would get up in the morning, look out the door of the tent and check the weather first. And if the weather looks OK, then we would go out and we would um, go on the skidoos to the nearest rock outcrops and um, walk up some mountains, collect some samples and um, yeah, enjoy the views, make some notes. And pretty much that would be the day. We just come back at the end and then I would write up my work in the evening. Um, I just love the way it's so pristine um, that very few people get to go there and when you're just there with only one other person it's so quiet and so isolated and it's just a really special feeling. It's like trying to survive, I suppose. If you're just in a tent with one other person, um, then you have to do everything for yourselves. Um, so that's cooking, washing, if you bother with that, <laughs> um, eating, you know, putting together the camp, everything you have to do for yourselves. So it's quite hard work. And um, you have to get on with the other person as well for sort of six weeks at a time with not much outside contact. So that can be quite difficult. Um, I would listen to music, talk to the other person that I'm with, um, sometimes cook a special meal if the weather's not good and we have a bit more time. Um, and this time I was able to send some emails home as well, which was nice. Um, I think I miss my family most of all, so I have a three-year-old daughter. So I missed her a lot this year and particularly because I went over Christmas time so all the festivities and things involved with that. Um, it was sad to miss those. Um, and I also miss food, <laughs> fresh fruit and vegetables in particular. Um, yeah and just green grass as well. It's amazing when you come back you see the difference because you've been so used to seeing snow and ice and the whiteness and suddenly you notice the green. It's really nice, yeah.